Welcome to AlzheimersMD.org. Visual hallucinations in a patient with dementia, what do you do? I'm William A. Van Horn, MD. I'm a medical doctor who specializes in all areas of memory loss and advanced dementia. I'm a geriatric neuropsychiatrist, which means I do some neurology and I also manipulate the chemistries of the brain, which is critical with someone with advanced dementia who is visually hallucinating. This question came from a professor in Egypt and he's asking me, what do I do? First of all, the most common cause of visual hallucinations is Lewy body dementia. The next most common, or they're right close to each other, is a delirium. If it's a delirium, which is a transient, short-term change in the brain functioning due to some type of infection, you've got to treat the underlying cause. So if it's because of a delirium, if you treat whatever's causing delirium, they'll go away. But let's say they're permanent, they're there all the time, and it's not because of a delirium, it's not because of an infection, not because of a chemical problem in the blood. In that case, what you do is you treat the response to the visual hallucinations. In other words, they almost never go away, particularly in Lewy body dementia. When I'm seeing a patient, I have to determine, is this problem because there's something physically damaged in the structure of the brain, or is this problem because there's a chemical problem in the brain? I can fix the chemical problems in the brain. I can't fix the physical structure that has been damaged by decay or by brain cell death. With Lewy body, it actually appears that there's a physical structural abnormality in the brain causing them to visually hallucinate. And they'll see some vivid things. I remember one guy was going in the bathroom and he was seeing a woman in the mirror. And then he was becoming very upset and he would start screaming and yelling. When I was done treating him with the proper medication, which is in the Alzheimer's journey, I go over all the details because it's very extensive. Once I got done treating him, he still saw the woman in the mirror, but he wasn't unhappy. And he could still hang out with his wife. He wouldn't get upset. They could still go place together, still eat dinner, but the hallucinations had not gone away. So if it's caused by a structural abnormality in the brain, then you treat the agitation, the depression, the anxiety associated with it, and just accept the visual hallucinations. If it's caused by some kind of infection, you treat the underlying cause of delirium, and they will go away. Thank you for joining me at alzheimersmd.org, the place where you learn how to prevent Alzheimer's disease, slow down memory loss, and help a loved one who is suffering with advanced disease. We have an exciting new guide that summarizes my approach, my medical approach to Alzheimer's disease, showing what medications are bad for your brain that accelerate memory loss, showing medicines what are good for your brain. Download it now.